Tagline FS has been involved in the biodiesel industry since its inception in the early 2000s. I remember selling it in five gallon buckets and asking more money just for people to use it at 2%. So we've been committed from the very beginning. Ironically, I think at that time, uh, just prior to that, Peoria, Illinois was in a potential non-attainment. Uh, area which we knew that that could affect some fuel pricing and boutique fuels could possibly come in and we felt that the V20 was a very good fit um, that could that could help our customers you know lower some emissions and just help the overall cause. The V20 probably came in about the 2009 era for Agland FS. There again, we approached our customer base about using the B20 for various reasons. We decided that we needed to try it ourselves, and to this very day, we've been running the B20 in our units around the company. We get a nice fire, we get nice combustion uh, off a diesel engine with the B20. Therefore, I think we get less particulate matter, uh, overall greenhouse gas emission, it's a fuel that's generated here in Illinois, it's grown, it's made in Illinois, it's promoted in Illinois, and I don't know, it just feels good about it. We have eight different petroleum trucks. We also have uh, six, six different propane trucks. We've got, we're in the fertilizer grain business, so we have uh, over-the-road semis, uh, we've got tender trucks, uh, anything, basically anything, everything from a pickup truck all the way to a semi and in between is, is what we operate B20 on. We run 12 months a year, so does our customers. And I, I always like to note when people ask 12 months out of the year, yep, it gets plenty cold here in Illinois. But there again, if handled correctly and with a good thought process going into it between customer and supplier, it's a, it's, it's a no brainer and it's simple to do. When moving towards a B20 year round, we want to look at different steps. We want to make sure the filtration on the uh, tank matches up with your busing. We want to make sure that uh, your tanks are clean. We want to make sure we give you good quality biodiesel. And we watch what the cloud levels are on the biodiesel when we, when we are trying to go for a year round B20 program. When they take everybody collectively and they see the emissions they've reduced collectively, that feels pretty good. So I think that's it. To me personally, that's the best part of the B20 Club. I grew up on a farm. But Agland is owned by farmers. Uh, basically, the farmers grow with whatever feedstock that we're, we're using in the biodiesel. So basically, whenever we use biodiesel, we're actually helping our owners and helping the, the, the local farmers. Mm -hmm.